Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we will be painting this apartment that I'm in. Uh, this is another turn. I didn't do any of the turn, but I will be doing the painting. Today I am pulling out the big boy painter because this is, uh, I can just put it into the five gallon bucket and I pretty much can run this hose all the way upstairs. It's 50 feet long and I can run it all the way upstairs and pretty much hit all the walls in one quick pass. It'll probably take me about two hours or so. And then I have this gray paint right here. That's going to be the trim right there. And that's a little bit older version of that paint. Hopefully they match. Some of these doors have nicks on them and I'm going to try and hopefully the, the color matches so I can take care of that real easy. I got a couple spots to say in like right there. Uh, the, this one isn't too bad. Not nearly as bad as one of the other ones. I do have to paint the ceiling only because there was water damage. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's water damage right there. And it kind of went in a dripping pattern like that. Um, this apartment, like I said, is not too bad. I meant to bring my drops, but luckily uh, the guy that I'm doing this for, he had some of that. So that'd be enough. I got a guard anyway to kind of shield the overspray. Going upstairs. Give you a feel for what this place looks like. And I should be able to paint it fairly quickly. I'm gonna run around, take all the receptacles off. That's what I'm doing right now. This is the kids' room right here. People, don't let your kids write on the walls because it just makes it a pain. You see this red right here? That red is just coming through. Almost nothing I can do about it. Hopefully, once I put the color on, that red will go away. Got a couple more spots to sand right here. Take these receptacle covers off. I'll probably end up rolling the bathroom only because it's such a small space. I gotta put a little mud right there. Fix that spot right there. They didn't do a tub surround in this one. This one has the original tile, but they need to because that looks disgusting. And here is the master. The master only had, this is a two bedroom. Master only had a couple spots naturally that you would, you know, around the doors and light receptacles that would actually need some kills on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run around, hit everything on the floor as far as covering it up as much as I can. And then uh, once I get started painting, I don't want to stop. So I want it to be one fell swoop. I just come through, hit all the walls. And then after that, then it's trim. And I got a couple brushes for that. And then rolling the ceiling, which shouldn't take too long. And then rolling uh, the bathrooms. There's two bathrooms in here, one downstairs. So I'm going to end up rolling both bathrooms.
All right, I have finished with the living room, hallway, stairs, and the two bedrooms. So um, in the process of cleaning up the Greco sprayer right now. So um, I just got to drain everything out. That's actually, I watched that paint. <clears throat> got to get some paint. I mean, get, get some of this water over here. Call me crazy, but I hate getting paint all over my paint sprayer. I like to try and keep it clean. Uh, so I'm going to finish this up real quick, and then we're gonna go ahead and roll. Then we're gonna go ahead and roll the kitchen, this bathroom, and the bathroom upstairs. All right, I have done the vast majority of the painting. I haven't done the ceiling, but I've pretty much done both bathrooms. I've done the kitchen. Uh, the living room and the two bathrooms upstairs. So I'm at the point, it's kind of got dark on me. I really wanted to finish today and I could, but I got somewhere special to be tomorrow and I got to make sure I get up on time. So I won't be able to finish tomorrow, I mean tonight. Um, so I'm gonna have to come back tomorrow, no big deal. So tomorrow all I got to do is paint the ceiling here and in the kitchen and cut the entire house, all the, the, the darker colors and that will be it for this apartment and then clean up after myself. Uh, it hasn't been too bad of a job, so it uh, took a little bit longer than I wanted, especially I had to go over two or three times some areas to get the kills to kind of fade away or to fill in where the kills, where a lot of these stains are. Um, I knew they were gonna come through, so I, I really hit them kind of heavy, so I won't have to then come back another day to then set up again and hit them again. So the walls are looking good and I barely can see any of the stains now. So that's a good thing because the last thing I want to do is what I had to do in the last apartment, which is come back several times to try and get the stains to go away. So I guess we will continue this tomorrow. All right, so you guys see me do a little bit of rolling. This is day two, and I am officially finished with this particular apartment. Uh, I ran around, did all the trim, uh, painted the ceiling, as you've seen, did as much as I could or as much as I could see. He might have to uh, come and critique me, and I might have to come hit a little spots if he doesn't hit him himself. So uh, I pretty much got my mess up, a lot of the stuff that I had, the uh, drop and everything. Color came out nice. It didn't shine too much. Uh, kills was good. None of the stains came through, which is good. Went around all the trim, painted a little bit of the door because it was bad here at the bottom. A little bit overspray, but that's nothing. Painted that, painted the walls. Uh, like I said, did the ceiling. So yeah, bathrooms are done. Did both bathrooms. So this is another one that's a wrap. Um, I might have a couple more jobs this week, a couple of jobs. But some of them I'm gonna have to turn down because the pay is just not worth it. Actually, the job tomorrow, the pay is not worth it. So I'm gonna uh, text him tonight and say, can't do that, man, because I gotta get paid. <laughs> My skills are worth too much. So uh, yeah, I won't be doing the job for tomorrow, but we got some new adventures coming on the channel. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys in whatever I'm doing next.